Hi guys! Welcome back to my channel. This week's video is one of my most favorite types of videos to film. It is another video from a True to Fit series featuring the Gucci Jordan loafers. I figured I might as well take advantage of Lily's most recent purchase. But before we get on with this video, if you guys are brand new to my channel, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below just because I currently don't have a regular upload schedule. So the easiest way to be notified when I post a new video is by hitting that subscribe button down below. And if you want to make your life a little bit easier, you can hit the bell notification button. Without further ado, let's get on with this video. Lily managed to score a pair of Gucci Jordan loafers during the early access designer sale at Holt Renfrew for 40% off. So if you guys are definitely interested in a pair of Gucci Jordan loafers, head over to Holt Renford for all my fellow Canadians because the sale is now opened to the public. If you guys have been watching me for a while, you guys know I'm all about the skulls and prices. The Jordan loafers retail for $870 and Lily managed to score them for 40% off at $519. Which, to be honest, is still a little steep in my opinion, but she has been eyeing the Jordan loafers for a few years now. And before you say anything, you're probably wondering, why the hell am I filming a true to fit video on the Jordan loafers when they have been around for a few years? Well, honestly, I feel like they're such a classic shoe. They've been around for years, and I feel like it's going to be around for another few years. Funny enough... This is not the first pair of Jordan loafers that Lily owns. She actually owns the exact same shoe, but in the velvet style. Uh, these are the Gucci Jordan velvet loafers with the GG logos kind of embossed throughout the shoe. And to be honest, when she picked this up during Boxing Day or pre-Black Friday, when did she pick this up? Black Friday. She picked this up during Black Friday, I remember now, because when she spotted these shoes, she literally shoved me out of the way to get her hands on them. So you think owning the velvet pair would kind of satisfy her lust for the shoes, but to be honest, I kind of understand because velvet is a very hard material to wear during the summer. It is more kind of like a fall, winter type of shoe. So I get it. I understand why she wanted the leather pair. If you guys are interested in the Gucci Jordan loafers, this video is definitely for you guys because the fact that she owns two pairs, we totally can vouch for the fact that the sizing for the Gucci Jordan loafers are pretty much all over the board. When it comes to flats, Lily is usually a standard 36 across the board. She usually only has to size down when it comes to heels, but for some reason, with the Gucci Jordan loafers, she had to size down twice. Lily first dipped her toes into the Gucci loafer world with the Velvet Jordan loafers. She ended up picking up these in a size 35 and a half, whereas in the leather pair, she ended up picking them up in a size 35. She completely had to size down one full size, which was a little odd because she just assumed since she was size 35 and a half in the velvet pair, she would completely be a size 35 and a half in the leather one as well. But when she was trying them, they literally was falling off her feet when she was taking a step. Like honestly, I should have just filmed this. I always think of the, these things much later, like silly me. I should have just filmed them when she was in the store. While she was trying on the shoes, I quickly Googled just to see if anyone else would have the same type of problem. And and I managed to find one blogger who had the exact same issue. If you guys are interested, I'll link her post down below. But when it came to the velvet loafers, she pretty much had stated that they were true to size, which I can kind of say they are. With Lily, because she does have kind of more narrow skinny feet, sizing down half a size was not that big of a shock. And when it came to the leather pair, the blogger had also stated that she had to size down at least half a size. So I highly recommend sizing down at least half a size if not a full size, especially if you have skinny, narrow feet. Since they're leather, apparently they will stretch out quite a bit after a few wears. Even with the leather pair, when she walked, she had a bit of a heel slippage compared to the velvet ones. Apparently the velvet ones fit her like a glove. She has no slippage whatsoever. Even the sales associate had offered to give her kind of padding in the shoe to take up some space so she doesn't slip out so much her heel. But I feel like with a pair of no-show socks, she should be fine in these. This pretty much wraps up this True to Fit video featuring the Gucci Jordan loafers. If you guys are interested in them, hopefully this video was helpful to you guys. If it was, please give me a thumbs up and I'll definitely see you guys in my next video. Bye now!